Hey, how are you doing everyone? Today I got another wonderful video that's going to help many, many users. But first, let me give you a little introduction. A few people are asking me, you know, who's behind the mic, the name, uh, who's behind. Okay, by the way, my name is Dario. So you guys, uh, when you post it, you can say my name, Dario from Media Box. Okay, so since Dario's here, let's go and let's fix some of the problems the users may have. So this particular video we're going to take care of a bigger problem uh, it seems everyone has issues running Google Play I got uh, many posts uh, when my Google allowed me to create an account it's not respond my Facebook is not updating uh, I get incompatible version you're getting all kind of different problems on the Google Play now I'm not going to be able to emulate the problem you may have, but I think this will fix it, okay? Because I'm, I'm trying different boxes and I, I don't have the same problem, okay? So what I'm trying to do is figure out what could be the problem. So I'm going to put you the fix. Then you guys have to let me know if this works, if this helps you, okay? There are a few things we went over before. Try to reset the box, okay? And from factory settings i think we went over that and i got some users say no that still not work i'm still having the same problem that don't fix it so went over try different boxes and kind of emulate to see okay let me see what's going on let's check what is the latest version of google play and then let's see how i can update it google play without using google play because how are you going to update it if you're not going to be able to log in in the beginning so we're going to have to do this on a windows machine or Mac, Uvent, or Unix, any machine you may have in your house, um, you're going to have to follow my instructions. It will be simple and easy to do. The only requirement is you need uh, any USB drive, USB ton drive, or any 2 gigs, or 1 gig, 512, or, or any memory. You can put a memory slot into the side, depending on the box you have. So you need some of the external storage to be able to update this box. So look around and you draw some, pretty sure you got the 500 Mac or those one gig laying around in the house. Well, you use normal used to try and fit pictures. That's what I'm going to need. All right. So let's see the problem now. All right. So let's see. I'm running now an MS8. As you see, I execute Google Play and I got this particular problem. All white. Nothing happened. By the way, it will be the same thing if you're running MX Pro or any type of box. But this one was good because it gave me that particular problem, but they have before, so click again, and nothing happened. Okay, and still having the same exact problem. So we're gonna do it one more time in case we just do it from the main apps. It's no different, the other one is just a link, just, just to approve. So we're going to do at this point, they said maybe you should try this first. We're going to go into settings, advanced settings. I'm sorry. Yeah, more settings. I uh, remember this is uh, 411. That's why it's a little different, but on the 5.1 should be the same. And what we have to do is clean. We're going to, we're going to stop. We're going to uh, force it first to stop. Press OK. And then we're going to clean the data. And let me, I'm going to actually pause what I'm doing in the background. Okay, so I paused the video for a minute. What happened is I pre-record this. And what I'm doing, I'm going voice over. Because I was not sure if it will work or not. So that's why I just paused the video. It's not as hard for me to go over and explain. See, what I'm using is 411 KitKat because it came in that particular problem. There may be some user may have that problem too. If you got 5.1 or 5.1.1 in uh, MX Pro, then you have to go to in uh, different locations. In my case, as you saw before, I went to settings I went to, and I went to a different location. And if you have a problem, I'm gonna put a link on this video to show you how to get 
into the preference of Google Play in case you don't know, okay? Because maybe you look at the box and say, I don't have enough Pro. Mine looks different. Mine, okay. Eventually, it's all the same. It's just, you just grab it from different locations. So I'm going to put it in the description. But then the rest, exactly the same. Just follow the video. It will just open your mind anyway. It will say, okay, I know what to do now. That's the whole idea of this video. And, uh, I guess that's the whole idea of the YouTube videos. So it kind of opens your mind. And I kind of you understand better, even though it's not exactly what you have. So, okay, let's keep uh, going with the video. Okay, so we go up again. We're going to go to Intugo and Google Play. We're going to force a stop, okay? So we're going to force a stop first. And then we're going to clean the data. So this is the first thing you got to do. See if that will fix, fix your problem. We click the data. It's okay. All right, so we're going to execute again Google Play. And you see that fix my problem, the freeze problem. So that will be the first thing you do before you try anything else. We click on it. It takes a little bit longer. And as you see, recognize me. I accept. And now we got it. It's pretty easy. By only clean the data. Okay. First, force a stop and you clean the data. We see my applications. This is what we got here. And one thing you notice, I'm going to check now. Let me see. I'm trying to go settings. And pay attention to that. Uh, build number, version build number. What, what we see there? 6.17, 7.13. Very important. Pay attention to that. Remember that number. So now the idea is we need to try to get the file. We cannot get it through Google Play. So I figured out a place where I can get it. No worry, we'll put the link. You need to memorize the URL. You see the different version there? You see the latest version now? 6820. Remember, mine was what? Mine was like 6, 7. It was different version. So what we're going to do, we're going to download it in your computer. Okay, so we're going to try to download it. And I hate it when they do this so complicated. You don't know what link to play. And that's why sometimes people get virus thing. So you click in the wrong place. You see, you click that one and start downloading now. That's not. So you got to really pay attention. So it's taking me a while to figure it out. I was going to edit, but I leave it on purpose to show you sometimes how tricky it is. But actually, that's the file you need to download it, okay? Don't get into those downloading now. That's a problem. You can download that, that one. No worry, I'm gonna put a description on on the page. The problem is this when I make this video this is today, uh July second, the problem that people maybe see this video a month, five months from now, and the versions are different. So I'm gonna put the whole entire list because I'm sure days from now or tomorrow is a different version, okay? So that's why I don't wanna put a straight link to that download because may the version change tomorrow or, or now since I did the video yesterday. So I downloaded my computer. In case you guys know how to do that, you download it whatever location, the mine is down low. Some people download straight to the C drive or desktop. So the idea now, we're gonna copy paste or cut and begin to do it right in my four gigabyte uh, time drive. They don't need to be four gigabytes. As you see, it's real small file. Even I got all the files there, Cody. So I paste it there. What is 100K? I'm not sure. It's hard for me to see it right now uh, in the edit mode. And we see the version again, 6.17. Okay, since we they copy now, we're going to see I already detected because I installed the USB drive. And they detect it. And we're going to go and to my local file browser and already detected a if you guys have problem how to detect the drive i have another link where you can follow my uh, video and i show you how to install an external drive so you can have a uh, two videos in case all right one uh, to show you how to clean and config in different version and also another one in how to uh, 
install the um, external hard drive. I will put the links in the tab as as we talk also. So we did install it. Okay. And I can click open, but not to confuse people, but I'm gonna just exit out. And let's just secure Google Play. And run it fine. And let's go and check the version. And as you see now, we have the latest version. So maybe this fix your problem because we updated to the latest version. Now, if you run in the same version, you run in on uh, on the website. I'm gonna give it to you that link. Maybe you want to clean the data or reinstall it and see that will fix the problem. Then now we're gonna we're gonna check some of the applications I have. And this is what I installed in this box. Okay, and it seems to be no update. So let's see now if we can execute uh, Facebook. Actually, Facebook is not installed, so we're gonna actually go and install a uh, Facebook. Okay, so we're gonna search for Facebook. This is not installed in my box. Okay. You get to see a lot of people having problem with Facebook as well. So let's see now if it works. Yeah, this should be fix your problem. So um, make sure you follow the video. It should be, if you have any problems, let me know. And remember, I'm going to put different links into the box. Really download it. Oh, let's look also uh, for YouTube. Okay. And I'm going to put the links on it. Uh, in case you don't know how to use an external drive. Um, how to clean the data and applications in MX uh, Q Pro. So that should give you a pretty good idea in case you are the first time you see one of my videos. And all will be in the description. And as you see, Facebook is started, and I'm going to go over to the whole uh, process on Facebook. All right. So now we're going to um, execute YouTube. Wait. I can see some people have problem with that too. And you come up in a minute. And it's coming up. All right, guys. So with this, we we'll complete the video. Please make sure you, if you did fix your problem, just put a comment. Click like on it so you guys can help me to promote the channel so that we can I can create more videos and just share this video. You know, this anything will help me to grow the community and for me to create more videos for you guys. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you very much.